Hey, what's happening guys? Before we start today's video, I just want to thank you all for your outpouring of support. It means a lot to me. Now, on with the video. So what we've got here is an Arduino based synthesizer. It'll do both FM synthesis and wavetable synthesis. Right now we're doing some wavetable synthesis. And um, the software I'm using is called Mozzie, M-O-Z-Z-Y. I will put a link down below. So let me give you a demonstration here. I'm gonna power up the speaker. I don't know how well you can hear that. It's kind of a very low sound. But you can see over here we have frequency control. We have a bandwidth control. And we have a center frequency control. That should be about enough of destroying your ears. Now let's talk about how we put it together. So I'm using um, three slider potentiometers, they're 10K a piece. You can use um, rotary pots, no trouble whatsoever. And these three are our inputs, they are analog inputs, so they are going into the Arduino at analog zero for the frequency, analog one for the bandwidth, in analog 2 for the uh, center frequency. Now we also have coming out of pin 9 our audio which I've broken out here and it's just going to this little amplified speaker uh, doodad thing. And that's really all that's required for your physical hookups. Now there are some other things we could do like I was going to use this speaker which you've seen in a lot of my other videos but the sound was too quiet so I thought well I'll just hook up a, a TDA 2030 but then I thought oh well you know what if I do that then I'm gonna need a, a dual rail power supply and frankly this morning I, I just don't have it in me <laughs> so we're just gonna go simply with an amplified speaker now let's go over and take a look at the uh, Mozzie software for Arduino. I think it's pretty cool and I, I think you'll enjoy it. So here we're looking at the software and I will put this link down below but it is sensorium s-e-n-s-o-r-i-u-m dot github dot io slash m-o-z-z-i slash and that brings you here to the Mozzie page. And it gives you some uh, little examples here. Different sounds you can make. The one we did, uh, let's see, examples, is sensors. I think this is it. Wave packet. Yeah, that's the one we did. But all this information is here. There's your examples. Um, it has an introductory tutorial. Tells you how it works under the hood. All that good stuff. They have a forum where you can discuss with other folks what's going on. We have the API here that will give you some examples of the stuff that is needed. So you know, if you want to know what the functions are, you can come down here and you can check all the functions, what they are as well. 
you can come over here to the GitHub page, go to code, and download the zip. Once you've done that, you can bring up your Arduino, go to sketch, include library, add a zip library, and then you can just add it. And you'll find it in there under your examples. And let's roll down here and find a mozzie. And there's all of the stuff ready to go. Basics, control gain, sine wave, different types of control, uh, the wave packet, FM synth. We'll do the FM synth next. Let's take a look at what's going on there. So here's our FM uh, synth sketch. Audio comes out on pin 9, potentiometer on pin 0, and an LDR on pin 1. So we can use the setup that we already have. So tell you what, let's send that over to the Arduino right now. It's uploading. It is uploaded. And let's take a look and see what the uh, FM synthesis sketch does. What do you say? All right, we just uploaded the FM synthesis sketch. Power on our speaker. Oh my. Pardon me, that was very loud. There we go. So as you can see, with one simple setup like this, and by switching the different sketches and the different uh, features of Mozzie, we can get lots of different sounds. Let's take a look at one more. What do you say? All right, let's go back into our examples for Mozzie. Sensors, control. Control tremolo. Wave packet, piezo frequency, scrubber. Input control filters. Portamento. Synthesis. Brown noise, detuned beats, different tones. FM synth. Here's, let's try another. Uh, let's try a. Pulse width modulation phasing. So we have our output on pin 9. And I guess we don't need any, uh, any inputs for that. So let's ship it over to the Arduino. Uploading. Okay, it's done uploading. Since there's um, no no control here, I'm just going to turn it on and bring the speaker over to the mic. That's really all we get out of that one. Let's take a look at another one. Might be uh, somewhat more interesting. But that's what I like about this Mozzie is that it's just super simple to use. Come on. Basics, control gain, sine wave, skeleton, table resolution, control. What about this one? Let's see what this one does. Ah, there's no there's no controls with that one either. So what I'm looking for is another one that has controls. I know this isn't much of a tutorial, it's just kind of you coming along with me. Synthesis, control filters, smooth, smooth frequency, audio input, sensors. All right, let's try. 
light temperature multi oscillator. See what that one does, huh? So pin nine. Analog pin one, analog pin two. That one should work out all right. All right, I'm going to upload that one over, and we'll hop on over to the uh, Arduino and have a look at it, all right? All right, that one's done. Let's power it up. It's very cool. To me, that sounds almost like a church organ. I enjoy that. All right, very cool. Well, that's all I've got for you guys today. I'm just playing around with Mozzie, and I thought I'd share it with you guys. Maybe we can uh, 3D print something and put this all together. If you guys are interested, if you are, let me know down below. All right? Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share. Don't forget to subscribe. Big thanks to all the patrons. Big thanks again to all of you who have reached out to me in this time. And, uh, in fact, it is uh, 11.41 a.m. on Sunday, December 19th at noon. My sister has arranged for uh, Blake and I to get snuck in to my mother's hospital room so that we might have a chance to see her perhaps for the last time so keep me in your thoughts keep my mom in your thoughts her name is rosemary and uh god bless all of you that's it i'm out peace